Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Happy Dimension Neptunia Rebirth 1. So in the last episode, we, uh, I guess we didn't make it here to Leanbox. We were already here in the previous episode. We did a bunch of story stuff. And then this last episode, we went to this dungeon, Microsoft Mountain. And it was a cakewalk. We are so overpowered at this point, I don't think you understand. I would go in for information, but I want to drop by and do a couple things first. First things first, do I have any new weapons? I could increase my strength by a significant amount with the Claymore, but I would be lowering my tech by a good 17 points? No, I'd be lowering my, yeah, by 17 points. My agility as well by 17, but it wasn't really what I was looking for. Ah, uh, would it be worth it for 137 more points? Uh, maybe. Okay, for her, this door her agility by 10, but would increase her strength by 90? Or, yeah, yeah, 92. That's quite possibly a good thing. I think I'm gonna get the Ven- Actually, before we do that, before we do that and I waste money, precious, precious money, let's see. I can do fortify enemies to make them stronger. Or I can do weaken enemies once I get another mysterious golden object. Uh, I have a bunch of those things, but for now, Bean Katana. I need Boxbird Wings. Boxbird, I don't think I've fought Boxbird yet? I'm sure I haven't. Uh, Time Bangles, which, you know, I, have, I don't have anything for. Um, all these things I don't have. Cool. Sorry to go through all these things again, but, you know, it's kind of necessary when I, uh, realize I'm in such a bad street. I'm missing a few things at this point. So, in dungeon order, it goes Virtual Forest, Monster Cave, Westwind Valley, The Lad's Sanctuary, Avenir Storage, and Microsoft Mountain. Then I'm guessing that means that these are all the bonus ones that I can do. I've already unlocked Zekka Ruins Metro Factory. I do not believe I have this one yet, so I need magical fragments as well as mysterious glowing objects. I need iron shells and slippery wings, as well as all those things that I don't have. So, first, before I officially start this episode, I know I got started you guys off, but I'm just rambling at this point, so I need to go get these items. Magical fragments and mysterious glowing objects. I think I'm going to do this before I go, though. Make all enemies stronger, which hopefully helps me. And I'm going to drop by... Uh, where were they? Maybe Monster Cave? Maybe, I don't know. I'm not positive. I figured this is as good a time as any. Let's show off La Delphinus. A holy magic born from one of the five ancient heroes, La Delphinus. Of course, the setting's only from IF's fantasy game. La Delphinus! Delphinus, I'm sorry. Gonna beat you up! Alright, and... Don't judge me by my love! Just cross combo to finish it. You're hurt. Or Leave not. I did These heavy too. dragoons are way ya. too beefy. They don't do any damage, though. And I didn't get any items. I've been doing this for a little bit. Actually, both IF and... I think, it was, yeah, it was Neptune. Both have leveled up. And they both have gotten new moves. I've equipped Neptune's new one, which is High Rush. Now, Iffy... What was yours? Demon Slice, I think. Repeatedly slice enemies with a weapon in each hand. Um... Remove Power Hit, so I can never start with that. I'm never going to use Break It. Raise this up to Demon Slice. Power of 29, Guard of uh, 125. So this does more guard damage. But this does more damage overall. Actually, no. Correction. This does more guard damage and damage overall. It's just less one-hit damage. I just realized something. It took me way too long to realize this. Wait, I have a map? 
Okay, it took me way too long to realize that. I have the wooden sword equipped again. Son of a... Awesome. No wonder I'm not doing much damage with Neptune. I was like, man, these guys are tanky. And then I realized that, like, if he was doing decent damage with her magic, and I'm like, mm, maybe it's because they have a high physical defense? Nope. I had the wooden sword equipped. Again. How long has that been like that? This'll hurt. That didn't hurt. What? Oh god, viral. Okay. Um. Here I go. It's time to do my best. So, who wants to get beaten first? Wish I had some kind of thing to do there, but I can't. So. This is gonna beat you up. Do critical edge. My status trumps yours. Leave it to me. I got you. Never yes. hurt. Leave it to me. Hey! I found a good test. Finally. Subject. There. This should do the trick. It's my turn. Iffy over here finishing everyone. Finally got the next magical fragment I needed, and rather than walking out, even though it's right there, eject button. Because I'm that lazy at this point. Yes, I'm really that lazy. Yes, you're gonna have to deal with it. And also, I'm gonna turn off the thing for this, since I don't need it on right now. Uh, where is it? West Wind Valley. Do not need that on. I still don't have enough mysterious glowing objects for that either. Awesome. Shots. So since I'm here anyway, I decided to take on the Ancient Dragon without a hard drive form. Am I super? And, uh, never had to heal. Not once. This is silly. This is incredibly silly. Oh hey, a Perfor, the thing I'm looking for. Prepare yourself! This is the end! Done! And I got the Mysterious Going Object. Cool, perfect, I'm out of here. Actually... I need more of them, but I don't want to. Um... Orton Fields. Add dungeon. While I'm here, I'll grab the other mysterious going objects, and I'll be back in a moment to show you the new dungeon. Surprise, surprise, I gave up. So we're going to Orton Fields to see how we do here. Okay, give me a moment, guys. Before we do that, I need to do one thing. No, I just don't actually like using that. I meant to turn that off between places, but I kept forgetting. And I just got surprise attacked by new enemies, so let's hope they're not super strong. Sure, it's fine though, right? Probably. Out of my way. I got you. I'd say it's fine. Leave it to me. It's time for your I did it too. Yeah, it's my fine. Turn. Yeah. I'll win again. So we got a small circuit from that, and these enemies are incredibly weak compared to me. They never hit me, so I don't know how much damage they deal, but, uh, they don't have a lot of HP or defense. Those guys look like the kind that do defensive ones. Leave it to me. Um... Let's do this. La Delphinus. And they're all gone. Don't worry, we'll win! This is incredibly silly. Incredibly Japanese as well. They're doing zero damage. Who wants to get beaten first? Out of my way. Where's the patient? It's time for your medicine. My turn. Gonna hit ya. That was easy. Hey! 
That was easy. Not yet. This. If you're hurt, I realize I'm supposed to be to commentating me. over this. I haven't been for so many fights it's now that I just kind of gave up trying to talk. <laughs> Oops. Um. This dungeon looks incredibly simple, and I shouldn't have much trouble with it as long as I get the layout. Okay, what do I need of these? Actually, first things first, I'm gonna go see if there are any new quests, so I'll be right back. Aha, I want to be famous in commemoration of the remake, Magical Wolf Things. So I'm removing my physical defense and add paralysis effects in favor of critical rate plus level 3. I decided to just burn one of those. I can reburn it later with a level 5. I just... I want to get the effect there. Alright. Actually, I need to start checking around for... items. Oh, when it gets... Okay, so this is where you get the delinquent masks. It's my turn. Cool. And I guess I'll commentate over this one since uh Out of my way. I didn't do that the first time I fought these enemies. And it kinda feel bad about that. This may hurt a bit. I found a good tech on my turn! Ah, managed to beat it, managed to beat it, and we're done. I like how I said I'd commentate and I proceed to say almost nothing for that battle because it was such an easy battle. <laughs> Alright. I guess this is a landing point and not actually a jump point. Or that's just disabled, so maybe it needs a switch. I was facing the wrong direction. Crap. Too bad they deal zero damage. And I think it's about time for another Legend of Venus. La Delphinus! La Delphinus. I can't wait! And Finally. dead. If you're hurt, leave it to me. It's time for your medicine. I'll do my best. Gonna beat you up. Boom. Done. Victory. Completed. So small circuits are not a rare item. They drop just about every time you kill one of those guys. Lucky. Plan. Add dungeon. Cool. So we have nothing to do over there for now. So instead, let's head this way. Blue seeds. All right. This dungeon is easy. We did it! I'm getting stronger. Fruit circuits, leveled up compa, and we're moving on. Whoa! What's this? Got some healing grass. So I found the hidden item here, so I don't need to keep looking. Um, I mean, there's an item here. Herb times three. I sadly cannot get up here. Which means if I want to do that, I have to go from over there, which means I have to do that jump point thing. The warp thing. Which I cannot do at this point. Lucky. Eject button times two. So I don't need to buy more of those yet. And I beat them all in one turn. Crude circuit and a small circuit. Which means I'm gonna have everything I need for plants eventually. Awesome. I'm gonna have to use that jump point from, or maybe not. I'm not sure actually. How do I reach anything? That one reaches up there, which, oh, okay. That one goes up there. I cannot use that one. All right, we already have enough for this dungeon. I'm gonna be honest, 
I don't really see a need to keep searching here. We're gonna come back here later, I promise that, but I kinda wanna just move on. To Tokaiden Cave. Wow, I suck. Oh well, these guys can actually hurt me. This is, it's been a while. Okay. It's been like two episodes or something. Episode two? I don't know. Okay, really? Why? Prepare yourself. If you're hurt, I can still hurt them a lot though, so... Just what can I say? Wow, I miss a first. lot with Neptune right now. Prepare yourself. Where's Next. the patient? It's time for your medicine. Here I go. Gonna beat you up. Oh, and again next. Pink ribbon and frozen cloth. All right. Earth Crystal. Down, Are these huh? guys just stronger versions of the ones from the other dungeon? I think their color scheme is slightly different. Right. Prepare yourself. Where's the patient? Hey! Gonna beat you up. Hey, that was easy. So, who wants to get beaten first? All right. I right. once again should be talking over patient? all this, but I'm not. Building up my EXE gauge by doing this. We did it. Got a pink ribbon from that. Okay, this is the destination point, so I don't have to worry about that. I just got a magical stone, which are not the items I was looking for all that time before. Oh. Whoa, what's Healing this? pod times four. Ah, I'm missing everything. La Delphinus. La Delphinus. I can't wait. Because I can. It's time for your medicine. My I did it. it. Hey, this should do the trick. Done. <laughs> How was Pink my ribbon and earth crystal. Up. A level twenty-three with Neptune. How far behind is Ify at this point? She is like a thousand behind, if that. Lucky. All right, pink pigment and many resets, level five. I am curious what many resets level five will do, so I'm gonna check that real quick. Near future, will we rank increases more easily after battle? Experience gained after battle will increase. Ooh, level five experience up. No new enemies. This one is a new enemy though. Uh. There we go. I wish Neptune had multi-target abilities, but she sadly does not. I can just target both. There we go. Sorry. Hey! I just didn't want to risk uh, Leave it to me. not killing one and then it getting Prepare healed yourself. and then me having to take more turns Prepare because that would kind of suck. Frozen Cloth and Red Sea and Ify has leveled up. I must be getting decent experience from this. Where does this go? To the exit. Of course it does. Why wouldn't it? Is this some kind of maze thing where it just tricks you and one of them's gonna lead somewhere special for the rest all lead to the exit? Because that would suck. That would actually really suck. <laughs> Apparently I missed this object for Special Controller times three. Which is... 
um, lowers damage received from avian type foes, so birds. All right, not a problem. Lucky. Plan for brisk cater, quite Qatar? I don't know. I really don't know how to pronounce things that have just a Q and not a U. Because, like, Quasar or Quasar, however you, however you say that word. Because there are different opinions on how to pronounce it. Lucky. Uh, it, it, it's a Q-U. It's, most things have Q-U. It's very rare to find something without a Q-U in it. Lucky. Oh. Add dungeon Gravidae's Ruins Received and Orange Pigments. Um... Refresh Herbs. Let's not deal with that guy. So, so far, the only thing I'm kind of bummed out about, like, uh, this game-wise, is that I thought this, like, the hidden items were, like, one of a kind, you got them and you can never get them again kind of thing. Kind of like these, uh... Hello? The final fight. I mean, if you're that determined. Kind of like those blue ones are. Like, you can get other items in the dungeon, but you can only get one of each of those blue ones because they were, like, items that were placed by the designers. And I thought that's how it was for all the hidden items, but sadly that's not the case. And that guy went down. Got another Earth Crystal. Got a Life Fragment out of that, so I can revive people as necessary. Custom Sound times 2 and Dragon Claw times 3. Sadly, we're not getting the item I need. I just need one more item and I can unlock the next uh, hidden dungeon. Next in this guy? Down, huh? I I'm not sure what enemy even drops it because the only item I found of that kind was one that was uh, in an item block, so I might need to leave hey. the dungeon and come back. Hey. And I got it. So I guess this episode will be the episode of random encounter kind of things. <laughs> um, Gravity's Ruins, unlocked. Now that I've unlocked that and I believe I've explored this entire place, we do we could find a BAMF here, but I tend to like having BAMFs all in their own episode. So let's go to Gravity's Ruins next time and let's play Hyperdimension Neptunia Rebirth 1. I know there wasn't a lot to do this episode and probably wasn't that interesting, I'm sorry, but I don't want to make this like an hour long episode even though this recording's already been going for an hour because I had to spend just like 20 minutes grinding. So I'm gonna head in here, I'll see you all next time.